Wally was in the second grade, most kids his age were in the fourth grade. He was already big for his age, a little clumsy, but he had a tender heart. He was the protector naturally of the underdog. He was loved by his classmates and his teachers. And so his parents encouraged him to audition for a part in the Christmas play. Wally wanted to be a shepherd, but because of his size, the director said, you might be a better innkeeper. You can add some veracity to that role. And so in the rehearsal, the director told Wally, he said, now, when you turn Joseph down, I want you not to bag down. I want you to say it with force so that people will believe it. And when opening night came, nobody was more fired up than Wally. And when Joseph and Mary came in the play, knocking on the door of the inn, Wally opened the door and said, what you want? And they said, please, Mr. Innkeeper, we'd like a room. And uh, he said, we ain't got no rooms. Go somewhere else. And they said, please, Joseph's character said, please, Mr. Innkeeper, you got to let us in. We've been traveling for several days. My wife is pregnant, almost due, and she's very tired. We just need a room for the night. And uh, Wally didn't say anything. He began to look at the girl who was playing Mary and to think about her being pregnant and tired and ready to deliver. And the director was backstage from the, uh, behind the curtain saying, Wally, say it again. Tell him there ain't no room. Tell them they got to go somewhere else. But Wally didn't say nothing. And the forlorn couple turned and began to walk away. And Wally, looking at that girl who was playing a pregnant Mary, tired and worn out, about to deliver, Wally said before he knew it, Don't go! You can have my room! Y'all got to get that, that it wasn't in the script, but he was willing to change his script to make room for the Lord. And that's a word for somebody here because often what it's going to take to bring peace in our lives is not in the script that you already have, but if you are willing to get off the script and make room for the Lord, he can bring you peace. 